Smile and learn. Hello, friends. Today we're going to explain how we calculate the area or surface of a circle. Many of you are asking yourselves, what is it and what is it for? A circle is a plain figure whose boundaries are a circumference. This means that the circle is everything the circumference contains. Or in other words, the circle is the inside of the circumference. Because a circle is a plain figure, we measure the area or surface of the circle in square yards, square inches, square miles. As you can see in this picture, the area of the circle is the total number of square units that fits inside the circumference. First off, let's recap some parts of the circle. Here is the center, and this is the radius. To find the area of the circle, we multiply pi by the radius square, meaning we multiply pi by the radius that is multiplied by itself. Also remember that for every circumference in the world, number pi is represented by the Greek letter pi, and it's an infinite number. 3.14159265358979323843 the digits go on and on in everyday life this number is shortened to 3.14 to express it in a simple way let's practice the radius of this circle is 6 inches to find the area of the circle we should multiply pi by the radius square in other words, multiply it by itself. Then we should multiply the result by pi. This means that 6 squared equals 36. And if we multiply 36 by 3.14, we would get 113.04. That's it! The area of the circle equals 113.04 square inches. This means that 113.04 squares can fit in this circle each measuring one square inch. It's very important to know how to measure the area of the circle. Let's look at an example. Anna wants to buy some fabric to make a new tablecloth. The table is round and its radius measures 50 inches. How much fabric will she need for the table? To find out, we should calculate the area of this round table. Remember that we should square the radius. In other words, multiply it by itself, and then multiply the result by pi. Let's see. 50 squared equals 2,500. And 2,500 multiplied by 3.14 is 7,850. Great. Anna needs 7,850 square inches of fabric to make a new tablecloth. Pay close attention. If we were patient enough to count them, we would see that there are exactly 7,850 squares on this tablecloth, each measuring one inch. But I don't think I'm going to count them now. <laughs> I'd rather calculate the area of other round objects instead, like the wheel on my bike, for example. Would you like to try measuring yours? See you around! We've learned so much in just one video. Did you know there are many more videos? Imagine how much you could learn. Subscribe to the Smile and Learn educational channel to learn and have fun at the same time.